Corey, just first and foremost, how did it feel to be back? Uh, you know, it's definitely good to get back out there. Um, you know, I've, I've said it, it was, it was a long time, uh, you know, the process to get to this point. So to kind of have all that come to the end and, and now just be able to, to worry about, you know, going out and trying to contribute to the team was nice. And how did you how did you feel about the outing tonight and what do you need to improve on the next time out? Well, um, you know, I mean, obviously the, the final line doesn't look very good, but I, I think that, that breaking it down, I think that there was a lot of good to take out of tonight. Um, you know, I, I feel like I executed pretty well for the most part. Um, even, well, obviously the, the home run wasn't a very good pitch. Um, but the other base hits leading up to that one, uh, you know, nothing, I guess the cutter for, for a single um, to Gosselin. But, you know, a lot of those were, were pretty good pitches, not a lot of hard contact, but then obviously made a, a bad pitch in a, in a big spot that ultimately ended up counting four runs. Was it was fatigue a factor at all, or were you okay? I didn't feel fatigued out there. Um, you know, I think you get you get in the game and the adrenaline kicks in and, and all that kind of stuff. Um, especially being the first one back, I didn't feel fatigued, so um, I'm not going to use that as an excuse. Thanks, Corey. Yep. Any other questions for Corey? Eric Bolin, please unmute. For the absence that you had, as long as it was, was there one element tonight that was most encouraging for you? I think, like I said, I feel like for the most part, I executed pitches really well the entire night, um, aside from the one that accounted for four runs. Uh, you know, I think that, I guess I, I try to I try to judge where I'm at based on that more so than results. Um, you know, I think results can can sometimes maybe uh, skew, skew your view of, of how you kind of fall out there, um, either good or bad. But I, I think that for the most part, uh, I feel like I really executed pretty well for the majority of the night. Um, I think Gary and I did a good job of, of keeping them off balance. Uh, you know, just one pitch I wish I could get back. Thank you, Corey. You know, next, Matthew Robertson. Corey, you were really good through the first time of the order. A lot of strikeouts, no hits. And the second time through the order, they started to get to you. Do you think that was them figuring out your sequencing or anything, or are you just leaving balls over the plate? Um, you know, I think they're major league hitters. I think you got to you take your hats on. Sometimes you're going to make good pitches, and, and they're going to find a way to get a hit on um, you. know, I don't think it has to be, you know, and this or playing that kind of thing a lot of times. Um, you know, you tip your head to them, you, you make good pitches, and you move on and try to make a good one the next time, too.